Welcome back to the channel, guys. Darth Sloan here, your partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. It has been requested that I do a gold rank or higher brown trout by the mark location and the gear challenge with it, which is a 2.2 pound line or less. If we look at it here, you can see I have set up 2.2. I'm going to go after seven to start with because I think I caught one on an eight pearl barley. I'm going to start the seven and hope that that works. Um, maybe drop back to an eight. Uh, the brown trout are really small on here. So I don't think that the doe is going to work on them. I don't think they'll bite a six hook. Uh, I think there might be something wrong with that. But what was that that just jumped up out of the water right there? Let's go ahead and cast over there. But as you can see here, the brown trout, I've caught a small bronze pearl barley. The doe, I'm, I'm telling you, put the six hook on, couldn't get anything to bite. So, trying the two for one strategy here, see if we can't get us a goad brown trout. Sometimes you have to cast around. I like to cast short all the way around, then cast a little medium, then cast a little long. Eventually you cast in the right spot and you get that goad that's in there patrolling somewhere. We just don't know which side of the dock or whatever he's on, so we gotta cast around. He's in there. We have to cast close enough to attract him over to the bait. So if he's on the other side, he's not coming for this. That's one thing about float fishing is you gotta cast somewhat near them. If you're not casting near enough to them, they're not gonna come over to it. Other fish are gonna bite it, you know, if anything else is in here after pearl barley. I don't know what other fish are in this area, but as you can see where we are at, this shape lake here, not bad at all to get here and just have to catch that brown trout. So we just cast around until it happens. All right, guys, we I thought I was recording, but I was not. This thing just bit my line. Please do me a favor, hit that like, subscribe, notify bell if you haven't already. That way you never miss one of my videos. I do my best to help in the community and provide things like those maps that you see floating around. I don't know if this is a brown trout or not, but we that's one thing I like about this community. We're all out there helping each other, sharing what knowledge we have with the hook charts and what baits they like and hot spots and all that. This community is unlike any other community out there. It's it's I really enjoy the way we share information with each other. And again, I have no idea. We're using a number seven we're using a number seven uh, pearl barley. I don't know, you know, what all fish are in this area. I hope it don't break my line. I tell you, when I go to 10%, it does not like it. I tell you, I thought I was recording. We just about messed up. I thought I was recording. And I just happened to glance over and saw it was not recording. I got a little button here I hit and evidently I didn't hit it good. And we were not recording and I was like, oh man, cause I, I thought I was recording when it actually bit and everything. I've heard people have had trouble with the brown trout. I think part of it is trying to catch it on the six doe. I just really don't think that that's what you go after them with. A six doe is probably diamond only, actually. They're, they're so small. I've, I saw a six pound goad caught. And well, if, if this is a brown trout, this is a goad. So we'll see. Or it could be a diamond, who knows, but. We're doing the challenge on the 2.2 pound line. We only missed about 10 seconds of the fight. I caught it early uh, that I wasn't recording. I think it's our brown trout. He looks, he's shaped like a brown trout. He's jumping out of the water like a trout. I don't think this is a cart. I, that's a nice looking eel swimming around out there too. You really have to take your time with these when you're doing these challenges. Really gotta play around for your drag. He'll wear out eventually. But I really think that's a lot of people's problem with the brown trout. They're trying to, they're going by, there's a bait chart out there. That's, I mean, 
not just that, the handbook says dough is their preferred bait. Maybe for a diamond, but I can't get anything else to, if you don't have a diamond in there, you're not catching anything on that six dough. <laughs> I've tried it. I mean, it's like a number eight, number seven pearl barley is what you're gonna be having more luck with on these things. We're at 5% drag and this thing's giving us all we want. What a fight. And I really think that all this is because we are under geared to catch these carp. The most people, are, the biggest rod most people are gonna have is the Devil's Advocate. After they've unlocked that, there's gonna be very few people that have that level 100 rod. I've got a few friends, Johnny Crow's almost there. Uh, Stevie's there over 100. There's not very many people over 100 that have that match rod that can go to 55 pounds for the float rods. So the rest of us are gonna be out here struggling to catch these carp. And I think that's why these challenges are like this to kind of let you know, hey, you can catch them. You're just gonna have to fight them for a long time and play with your drag. And that's what these challenges are teaching us. Patience, quit trying to muscle everything in, you know? As I preach to the choir and catch 20 pound fish on my 99 pound braided line. <laughs> Man, what a fight. Please be a brown trout. He mad. He's mad. That is a gold brown trout. See what I was saying? 6.7 pounds. That was a number seven pearl barley. And there is our challenge, guys. They do not get as big as they are over on Norway. Sorry, that like, subscribe, notify bell button has been stuck up there this whole time. <laughs> 40 reputation for that one. Um, Cause we got the two for one. But uh, yeah, I was preparing to do that little spiel, like, subscribe, notify, and all that, and then he bit. So I was like, uh, well, I guess that's just going to be stuck up there the whole time. But anyway, guys, there it is. We've done it. We, it's right here. Uh, quite a challenge, you know. And those brown trout on a on a 2.2 pound line are, are quite the challenge. Let me know, guys, which one that you would like to see next. This one was requested, so I'll just pick out these goads. I plan to do them all eventually, but let me know in the comments which one you'd like to see me fight next with that approved gear. There are several of them left to do. I've only got 370 rep, which I, I'm, you know, I work full time, so it's hard for me to get too much playing time in right now. Weekends is where I try to get more time. But thank you guys so much. Catch us over on YouTube. Tackle Tuesdays, 8 p.m. is when I go live for that. 9 p.m. the competition starts. And Scarecrow, Johnny Crow, and Bro Bra, and Big Rig, and we have a fun time over there on Tuesdays on YouTube. My other streams are on Twitch, Darth underscore Sloan, usually around 5 p.m. Eastern time. We'll catch you then. Thank you so much for tuning in, and we'll catch you in the next video.